Welcome to High School Football Weekly. I am Frank Wolf from WNY Athletics, and today I'm joined by Dick Gallagher of WGRZ High School Sports. And today's show is brought is sponsored by Scroy Financial of West Seneca, Plan, Protect, Invest, the Wester Family of Dealerships, and G and G Fitness. Also, StadiumBlitz.com. Register today for the StadiumBlitz.com. The first official event in New York is going to be held this Saturday at New Era Field. Twenty-five bucks gets you into a 5K race with an obstacle course, and you get to meet the Gronk brothers. How cool is that? Before we get this show started, I want to go through my rankings, my large and small school rankings. I'm taking a little bit of heat online for this, Dick, but hey, man, everyone's got an opinion, right? But here are my rankings for week going into week six. My small school rankings are number one, Southwestern. Two, Western New York Maritime Charter and Health Sciences. Three, Cheek to Waga. Four, Albion. Five, Franklinville, Ellicottville. Six, Wilson. Seven, Clymer Sherman, Panama. Eight, the Portville Panthers. Nine, New Fane. And ten, Pioneer. So new to the party this week are New Fane and Pioneer. My large school rankings, one through ten. Number one, St. Francis. Number two, St. Joe's. Number three, Canisius. Number four, Orchard Park. Number five, South Park. Number six, Lancaster. Number seven, Jamestown. Number eight, McKinley, number nine, Clarence, and number 10, Bennett. Those are my rankings after week five, and we'll have to see if there's any new teams jumping in next week after a a wonderful week six of high school football with that OP Lancaster game. That could have some effect on these rankings. You never know, but uh, we'll have to wait and see uh, what happens Friday night.